Good morning, bosses. What's up? What's up? What's up? Welcome, welcome. I want to make sure that you stay tuned for the entire video. Watch the video to the end, the one that's coming up. Did you register for the giveaway? I want you involved in the giveaway. Uh, listen, it's exciting to be a YouTuber in today's environment. I'm excited to be a, a YouTuber, but I'm excited about a lot of things in life. Just my life in general, I'm excited about it. But thanks for tuning in today. Today, we're going to be talking about titles. We're going to be talking about description. We're going to be talking about tags and thumbnails. Oh, my. So, listen, it's going to be fun. It's going to be great. Uh, if you have any questions, make sure you put them in the comment section. Before I sign off, I want to say thank you for coming in. Uh, we're signing off to go to... Da, 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 da. This is just my intro. Listen, um... Make sure you comment. If anything I say is of value to you. If you have any questions, please comment. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to comment. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if it's of any value to you. If you're new here, again, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're returning, thanks for tuning in today. You don't want to miss the video today. It's laced. It's good. It's ready. And it's for you. I'll see you on the inside. Thank you. guys i'm so happy you stopped by again my name is murthy hazel welcome to boss moves 2.0 if you're new here welcome welcome if you're returning thank you so much for stopping by we are excited but i'm always excited i'm always excited to see you guys step in here thank you so much for the comments that i've received uh and thank you for the ones that are tuning in for ta -da, the giveaway the giveaway. If you have not registered, look at the information below. Very few small requirements for you to get in there. Get in there. And so you can get registered because I would like new and growing YouTubers to take advantage of this. Okay? And somebody said, why you didn't just open it up for everybody? Because I but to everybody, and that is because I want to support growing YouTube channels and new YouTube channels. So make sure you register, register, register. And my email for you to register is bossmove020 at gmail.com. And that is a correction from what we thought we would have, but they kicked it back to me. Uh, so anyway, I just gave you the new email. So make sure you register uh, at that email address. Also comment down below. So anyway, let's get started. So what are we doing today? I thought I said we're doing tags, title, description, and thumbnail. Oh my. <laughs> uh, but nonetheless, we're going to start with title. Why is your title of whatever video you're going to release so, so, so important? Because search engines can find you. The SEO, search engine optimization, is in effect the minute that you drop a new video. So the way you have to talk to it, it's like a rhythm. It's like a rhythm. Hey, I'm over here. Hey, I'm over here. This is my name. The title should be capital letters. Remember that. It's only like 100 characters. So if you would like to um, uh, think about your title before you drop it, make sure you take your time with that title because that title is also important. It's also oh, so, so important. Why? Because that's a major part of who you are. After the title, the very next is the description. So in the description, of course, you have to mention the title. Always marry the title to the description at the very beginning of your description. Hey, you guys, signing in. This is what we're talking about today. It's going to be very, very informative or it's going to be exciting. It's going to be fun, whatever it is. And then tell them a little bit about what your title is about. And also in that description, if you uh, do um, 
uh, affiliate marketing or if you have other side hustles, you could put the link to them uh, in that bottom. Like in our in our uh, uh, description, we always add our merch, our, our email address for our merch, Boss Moves 2.0. Also, I'm a, a cancer survivor. Uh, and that's coming up in another video. I'm going to start a series on that because I did go to the doctor and they tried to tell me some other stuff. They tried to tell me some other stuff that's going on. And uh, then consulting with some other awesomely spiritual advisors and friends and loved ones. So we're going to start uh, documenting everything. And you're going to see some videos about that coming soon. All right, so I want to make sure you tune in for that. Um, also, in the description, you could add, I have in mind specifically, make sure you drop down in there because I covered some things about the stock market, how to get free stock. Uh, I got a couple of locations down there, and uh, I'm going to be talking about it in more detail. But take a look at some of the links also, like if you, you, you want to grow your channel effectively, I got a link down for the tripod, for your ring light, uh, for your camera. Those type of things are necessary, okay, to build an effective uh, channel. Um, I would like to uh, just strengthen my brothers and sisters that are growing their channel. We all are growing together. We're growing together. Uh, I'm a fidgety person. But anyway, in that description, make sure you be concise as possible. One of the no-nos for the description is try not to put maybe too many hashtags down there because that's a reason for uh, YouTube to flag you. If you, you can maybe put one or two, but don't just like load it up with hashtags. At one time, mine was loaded up with hashtags. Uh, it's because I was not aware. Uh, in my ignorance, I did not know that it was not good. It's not good fit for YouTube. Uh, it's almost like spamming. <laughs> so don't do that. Don't put a whole bunch of hashtags. One or two is acceptable, but just let that kind of be your limit there, okay? After the title description, we'll have our tags. And remember, I told you to join TubeBuddy. I'm a part of TubeBuddy and VNIQ. They give you innovative suggestions based on what you said the description is about, uh, some good thoughts for a tag. But if not, make sure you fill in that tag button. You don't have to put a hashtag. Just put in, like, helpful hints to grow your YouTube channel and then push enter, and it'll automatically populate into a tag for you or grow your YouTube fast, enter and create a tag. Tags should be as concise. Don't forget if the title says one thing, put that title in your tag and push enter. It creates a link for it. So I want you to know tags are so, so important and we have not been doing it. Not we, but many people have not been doing it. Tags are so important for people to find you and find your work and find your uh, YouTube. I even put in my tag, always, I put Boss Moves 2.0, and I create a link for it. You understand that your channel is valuable to you, so you want to have it recognized. Tags will do that, which will help you get optimized. I mean, get the optimum exposure for your video. And also important is our thumb -thumb -thumb thumbnails. Oh, if you look at some of my old videos, on purpose I left them like they are, they do not have a thumbnail. Because I didn't understand or discern the value of a thumbnail. Thumbnails are so important. And we could probably cover this extensively. But, of course, if you're part of TubeBuddy, you could automatically make a thumbnail. There are apps to create thumbnails. But whatever you do, create a thumbnail or YouTube will just pick one of out of three. If you're on the desktop, you know exactly what I'm talking about. One of the three picture still shots, they will use that as your thumbnail. Now this is in your um, YouTube studio, okay? YouTube studio will help you with so many different things. 
get familiar with your YouTube studio. In your YouTube studio, it shows you how to do your end cards. It shows you how to do the end screen. You know, when you see the person up at the top, that say, hey, watch this video afterwards. All of that's in YouTube studio, and you could utilize the YouTube studio to add that end screen. That end screen also pushes you further up in the uh, SEO, search engine optimization. Anything that you could do to bring attention to your video of course, we some of us may stand on our head, but uh, whatever you could do, jump and shout it from the rift, rooftop. What you're doing as a new release, you never know. That may be the video that actually goes viral. And wouldn't that be amazing for you? So do all of the things necessary so that all your work can get the optimum exposure. You need your title. It needs to be concise, preferably in capital. You need your description as clear as possible. That's why you could also add links to other things that you're doing, okay? You need definitely have to have tags. Every video have to have tags, okay? When you go down further in your editing process or your content page on YouTube Studio, those that have used YouTube Studio understand it's a big pencil push on that. That's for editing that video. When you could go down further, it's a place where you put not for kids or kid friendly. I like to put not for kids because it allows you to use comments, your comments. If you put that it's kid friendly, then, or yes, it's for kids, then you cannot put comments in that video. If you like your videos, make sure you actually do that. Another suggestion that I would like to give you is that once you upload it, always upload it unpublished so it won't go immediately out into the public. Uh, leave it unpublished until you finish your editing process, finish your title, finish a good description. Do everything that's necessary so that your video can shine like a diamond. Uh, you want all of that exposure for your video. So leave it unlisted, and then once you get everything ready to go, everything saved, then you go down onto that bottom right side of your screen and it'll say do you want to leave it uh, unpublished or do you want to make it private or do you want to make it public now if you want it accessible to everybody then you need to make it public and then right down another button you push done then go to the top and hit saved and then your video is out it's published so the next thing you could concern yourself about if there's a concern is timing okay when a uh, the only way you're going to know the best timing for your videos is to look in your analytics. It tells you the timing that a lot of people are watching your video and the percentages of the people that are watching those videos. So you want to make sure that the people that are watching your videos, that you get an optimum exposure, look in your analytics and figure out when they are actually watching those videos. Because you want to know not only who's watching it, to tell you ratio breakdown of the male and female that are watching your video, but you also see uh, the timing and what state, what country. Uh, ironically, a lot of people in Russia are watching my videos. There's a lot in the United States, of course, but there's a lot Africa and in Africa, and it said, there are a lot of people that are watching my videos, so I appreciate it. Look, can I say thank you? Thank you, thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart for tuning in to Boss Move 2.0. I love you guys. Don't know you personally, individually, but I love the fact that you have decided to watch my videos. Some get more exposure than others, and that's all right. I think that's normal, uh, but I would like to hear from you. So I would like for you to comment if any of these things has been helpful for you. Also like for you to uh, like, also like for you to subscribe to my channel only if you like the content. And guess what? Once you comment, I'll try to respond to all my comments. One of the things that I really like the fact is that if you have something to say, you will definitely say it. I have bold people that are following our YouTube channel. Uh, other innovative ways uh to uh, expose yourself is to make sure you post it on your social media right after you go public. So post it on, on your YouTube, uh, of course. Post it on your Facebook, Instagram, your Twitter, your LinkedIn. Some people have uh, a snippet of it can go on your uh, TikTok. Some people have Twitch. Some people have WhatsApp. 
It's so many social media forms that you could expose your video to. To get optimum results, you have to market that video. Get it out there. Don't forget how important your title is, how important your description is, your tags, and your thumbnails. Listen, if anything I've said today has been helpful to you, please Shout it out down in the lower comment section. Tell me a little bit about yourself. Tell me some of the things you would like to see me bring forward. Why? Because I'm excited to come forward and build my channel. And I'm sure you're excited to build your channel as well. Again, Boss Moves 2.0. I just love signing in, but it's time for me to sign out. Thank you. So thank you so very, very much for tuning in today. And don't forget to share this video. Toodles. Don't forget to holler back. Come back, come back, come back. Have a great one. Bye-bye. Before I get started, Listen up, like and share.